why can't a CHL player like Matthew Potra, or like the Matthew Potra situation, play in the AHL? So Potra is currently with the Boston Bruins. He is going to potentially stay with the Bruins. You know, he's playing very well. I don't know that necessarily that they will send him back uh, after his nine-game stint or if they'll let him go longer than that or if he maybe he just stays the whole season. Um, but the reason that he can't go to the AHL is because of his age. And there is the CHL AHL agreement with, or CHL NHL agreement, which basically stipulates, and this is basically stipulates that any player before their age 19 season or the night the, they're once they've played their age 19 season, in the CHL, um, then they can go to the AHL until then they can't, they have to go back to the CHL. It's part of the loan agreement that, that those two leagues have had. And there are a couple of reasons the NHL does this. This has been explained to me many times. I think there are definitely situations where it, it is harm, not, it isn't harmful necessarily to the player, but where it isn't necessarily that helpful. I think there's a lot more players that are, el- that, that are eligible or would, if they were eligible, could compete in the AHL, but why do they send these players back? The main reason is to kind of try it. There's, there's a couple things. First of all, it's so that the star players stay in the CHL longer. It helps with ticket sales and all those other things. So that's one reason. But another reason is because you're also trying to protect the integrity of the competition level at the CHL. Having players like last year, Logan Stankovin, for example, playing in the CHL is good for his teammates. It's good for the guys that he plays against. It's something that is a teachable thing for coaches. You know, here's how you go against elite players. This is how you have to perform um so guys like Poitra who are you know 18 or 19 essentially still have to go back to the junior ranks um and there's more more language in there that's specific to the the types of players we did see that you know Shane Wright who technically fell just shy of the requirement of games to have had his whole season counted in the in the OHL is was granted the uh, opportunity by all parties to go play in the AHL this year. So that's a little bit different. Um, a guy like Poitra, if he's not playing on the NHL roster, he has to go back to the CHL. That's the that's the key. Um, and so if he starts struggling and things aren't going well, the Bruins probably owe it to him and to themselves, you know, long term to send him back and let him play junior hockey. So it's not ideal, but it is what it is. <laughs> 